Hey, it's Clay Trader, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol CIE. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. Real quick, what do I mean by 30 minute in case maybe you're new to charts? Instead of each one of these candles here representing one day's worth of price action, which is what you would normally see, each one represents 30 minutes. So while this here may look like several days worth of time, it's actually just today's price action broken down into 30 minute time slices. I like to do this time frame. I think that's a good job of telling the quote unquote story of the price and then makes mapping out where levels of support and resistance a bit easier to see. So had some questions on this one, uh, a lot of volume in this one, uh, and you know one of these sub dollar stocks. So quite a few people talking about it. And really the, the key level that stands out to me immediately upon opening the chart uh, was where the buyers seem to be hanging out today. And that was right here at 70 cents. You can see price was temporarily below it, but after the price did get back up above it, multiple times the bears try to press down below there, uh, but the bulls to give them credit did a good job of holding. So as it stands right now, uh, people find 70 cents as a good deal. Now, are people gonna continue to find that as a good deal? That remains to be seen. You know, a chart's not gonna tell you that. Nothing's gonna tell you that. But as things stand at present time, you know, as the quote unquote story has told us, people are buying every single time it gets down to 70 cents. So that is what is creating this level of support. Now, the one thing that you gotta be very leery of is all this is happening in a downtrend. So there's a lot of weight being pressed down on things. Not saying 70 cents can't hold, uh, because there's you know there's no such thing as a guarantee so i can't say that this is guaranteed to fail but would i be shocked to see the price break down through 70 cents no i wouldn't be shocked but again just uh, you know to be fair you can't say it's for sure going to happen because there are no for sures in the market no matter what strategy you use but as it stands right now 70 cents that important level of support in the event that cannot hold uh, then it's looking like the price will be headed down to that 68, 69 cent range, give or take. Uh, but we'll see if that level can indeed hold. If the price can bounce and start to give you know an, another uh, move to the upside, then key level and initial level to watch is gonna be that purple line there, the 50 period simple moving average. You can already see it's acted as resistance a little bit here. And even if you have just a surface deep understanding of charts, I'm sure you heard of the 50 period and you know that when the prices blow it, it does tend to act as resistance. Not impossible to break, uh, but usually the bulls are gonna have to bring their A game in order to fight through it. So as it stands right now, interesting setup, especially with the way 70 cents acted today. So we'll see if this is the start of some sort of bottoming out or not. One of the most popular questions I get is, hey, Clay, how do you find the stocks that you trade? So what I've done is put together this free resource guide where I talk about the tools that I use to locate stocks that I find interesting and think may have potential. So if that sounds like something that could add value to you as a trader, then by all means, click right there to get access to the guide. The guide itself is very short and to the point. And like I say, it is free. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.